black magic constant i had no rest but the thing with magic you have to overcome it you have to overcome it you cannot be afraid of it you have to overcome it you have to grow you have to heal you have to evolve so that you can be a better person so it's like all of these attacks all these attacks it's like yeah i've been bullied yeah i've been bullied i've been bullied spiritually because i'm a big girl and it's like nobody can really uh, nobody will approach me because i am straightforward and i am direct and i'm i'm not gonna play with you like you can't talk to me so any any kind of way you cannot talk to me any kind of way you say what it is and it is what it is you know they won't approach me on the physical but they'll sit here and they'll play in magic and they think that I don't know. I know a lot. <laughs> I know a lot. And I know how to protect myself and I know how to send the energy back. You just send the energy back. The tea lights have been effective for me. I see it work faster instead of the glass and case candles because the glass and case candles, I thought they were just taking too long and then they were taking so long they were turning black and I was like, like, I just didn't like it. And then they were always, my candles were always black. They were always turned black. It's from the attacks. It's from the energy. People always sending this negative energy my way. And it was from all different kind of places. So it's not just one place. It's all different kind of places. I know where it's coming from, but then there's nothing you can do about it. Because spiritual things, you can't see it. You can't see it you can't explain it so you can't say this person is doing this and this one is doing that or they just mad or they just jump like you can't say that like you can't say that about a person because they gonna look at you like you crazy New York City New York City uh. <sighs> New York City I apologize for the noise but it's like with spiritual things everybody does spiritual work everybody does work everybody wants to hurt you they want to harm you they want to affect your life but then how can you say oh this person is attacking me in the spirit or they're doing black magic or they're doing this you can't say that because they're gonna look at you like you crazy like you don't know what you're talking about like oh my god I can't believe you said that why would this person do that to you and so it's like, you know, I had to sit there, I had to bite my tongue, I had to sit there and just clean this shit out, clean this energy out, and I had to move forward, you know, whenever I wanted to file a complaint, I will file a complaint, whenever I wanted to bring something to someone's attention, I will bring it to the person's attention, but you know, everyone in power, they have other friends in power, and then they're, they're just all corrupt. So you can sit there and you can complain and then they, they'll just hide it. They hide it. They'll hide it from each other because they don't want the most important person to see what have you been doing. I have been trying to fix things and the corrupt people in power keep hiding, keep hiding it. Like they don't want you to see what they have been doing all this time all these years what have they been doing they have been doing magic they have been doing black magic dark magic to hide all of the corruption and all of the sneaky things that they have been doing for years that's why i think they that's why it said the bronx is the worst borough because all of the other boroughs are cleaned up they have cleaned up brooklyn they cleaned up Manhattan, Queens, they cleaned up all the boroughs, but they haven't cleaned up the Bronx. They haven't cleaned up the Bronx because they keep hiring the same corrupt people in power. So these people have power, then you wanna hire their nephew or their brother or their sister or their, you know, you wanna keep hiring these same corrupt people and that's why the system will never change because what has to change is the way you hire people hire people that are qualified hire people that are knowledgeable hire people that actually want to help not feel privileged because they have the position because of who they know they are not qualified to have that position have that title 